I'm Dan McLaughlin and I'm a video game design teacher at the Cleveland High School for Digital Arts and right now we're working on teaching our students about math through game design and how parabolas are represented in some of the games that we play. Uh, Angry Birds is a really popular game that relies almost entirely on physics and arcs for the gameplay so we've created our own version of Angry Birds where we have a slingshot and we have some things that we can knock over and we also have variables that we can change like the mass and how drag affects our projectile and how gravity will affect the gameplay so with our gravity set at one if we go and play our game when we launch our projectile it flies very nicely if we were to increase the effect of gravity on our projectile and turn it up to say five instead of one that's represented in the game by making the object a little bit heavier you can see it didn't fly quite as far and if I was to turn the gravity up even higher this time when I fire it I'm gonna be lucky if it goes very far at all so you can see how by adjusting all these variables the students can get a very hands-on way of playing around with mass, drag, gravity, and a lot of different physics systems to help them understand the math.